Do you think you could quit social media for 30 days? Why or why not? I'm debating on doing this as an experiment starting June 1st, and I'll tell you why. Social media is a main, main aspect of many of our lives. It can be a very positive thing, or it can be a very negative thing. I like social media because I have a way to promote the Pixie Post channel as well as other aspects of my business. It gives me an outlet to create inspirational posts,、um, to put some more positivity out in the world, especially in a time of chaos like a lot of us are going through. And sometimes it's just fun to scroll through it and look at the funny memes and the jokes and the stories a lot of people have to share. However, Social media can be very detrimental to someone's mental health,、um, even physical health, if they let it go too far. It's a lot of self comparison, a lot of、uh, keeping up with the Joneses, a lot of negative energy that's spewed out into the world under a nominous username. And while this may be helpful to that person doing all those things, as far as Putting out those negative vibes because they're unleashing it out of their own、uh, self, it doesn't help the others looking at it. It feeds the energy of negativity and fear, and、um, also just not feeling good about yourself. And as much as I am a little nervous about doing this experiment, I'm really thinking about taking on this challenge. So, June 1st is the target date I have. Um, I will not be present on Facebook or Instagram,、um, not even on Twitter. I'll probably have some scheduled posts because, let's face it, we need to keep our business going. But as far as being an active participant, I am going to take a step back. And of course, I'll be able to text my friends, that kind of thing. But even with that, it will be limited. Just because I want to see what kind of change it can make to my life. And maybe when I come back to it, I'll be more intentional about using it. After the 30 days, I will make another video just to share with you what my experience was, how I reacted, or maybe any other surprising discoveries I might make. But I really think it's important that we all unplug once in a while because, as part of my spiritual journey, I'm looking for ways to change my life for the better、um, in small ways and in large ways. And with this simple little thing, I think I might be able to do it at least once or twice a year. And maybe it will recalibrate and reset everything for me.、Um, because when it starts becoming part of your life where you're really, really feeling down about yourself or you don't feel like you're Um, going as far in your life as others, even though a lot of that's under a smokescreen on social media.、Um, it really, really gets to the point you have to take charge, take control of that aspect, and unplug for a while. So we're going to see what happens.、Um, again, you will see a few scheduled posts, I'm sure, because I do want to keep some presence as far as the business side goes. But as far as the personal side, I won't be on at all for the month of June.、Um, I'm kind of excited, really nervous, but I really think this can be a good thing. And when I go back to it, or if I go back to it, I'm hoping to see things with fresher eyes and maybe a new perspective about myself and about my life. So. Anyway, I wanted to share this quick video with you guys.、Um, would any of you like to participate with me、um, starting June 1st? If you do, comment below. I would love to have you along for the challenge. This is just a challenge for myself, it's not really to get anybody to do it. But I really think from personal experience and sharing it with others, maybe it can help inspire someone else to do the same. So, I hope you guys all have a wonderful Tuesday. Thank you for watching. Please click like and subscribe. There will be some more videos coming out this week, including a full moon card reading that I will be releasing probably、uh, tomorrow or Thursday. So, be on the lookout for that. As always, 
To know thyself is to know thy truth. Namaste.